the time uh, I started to stay here, it was 1992. And I was staying in a terrible shack. When it's raining, because every winter season here in Cape Town, there is heavy rains. And we have put some, some bricks uh, on the floor because the water runs through in and out, you see. And you have to put the plastics on the top of the roof because the roof is leaking. Now we, we, we break off now. Now after we break off, we clean the space. Yeah. After we clean the space, then I took the measurements to see what, what we're gonna build up with the building. We're gonna put up is 4.8 by 2.4. Okay. So I'm just messing out where the also of the footing is gonna be. Yeah. So when that is in, then we start with the first floor. Now I mean with the floor, and then after that we put up the walls. After that we put the first floor and then the walls and then the roof and then the windows and doors and then the staircase and then we finish. <laughs> As South Africa mourns the passing of Nelson Mandela and celebrates at the same time, it's a, it's a wonderful time to actually be taking how we perceive informal settlement upgrading to the next level and it's taking the next level in terms of taking a double story. Uh, and we're hoping that this will be incorporated into the blocking out initiatives uh, so that it can create more space and give people more space in their homes and in public amenities. <laughs>
eyes over there. That's a good. Wow, oh, really. I can see now there is some change. I can feel it in my inside my heart. In the next two winter season here, there is almost 80 to 100 percent rain. So there's no more flood for me now anymore because of we raised the platform. And the other thing, the fire cannot pass through easily when the, the sharks bend. Anyway, it's nice because now I can see even my settlement as I look. I never thought that my settlement is, is look like this. So now, yeah, I'm very happy. I wish to see this area living better without uh, crime and with services, basic services like sanitation, electricity, water, so that we can wait for those subsidies from government in a better place. I want to divide this into two bedrooms. I'm gonna put a wall from this here um, up until here and here. It's gonna be a, a kid's room, then it's gonna be my room. Then I'm gonna put a, a door here and a door here so that my kids cannot access in my room. They can only go to their room and go out. Then I'm going to put another door here for my room. That is the plan, maybe next year. Uh, and electricity is already here. And I'm going to just put something, wiring, to light. Everything is good. It has an impact because now they're coming in numbers now. It seems like I'm a manager or what. They want also the same double story now as I have now. It has an impact. 